papers out, pencils. All right, guys. Today we're going to do volume of a cylinder. Okay. All right, so if you look at the top of your paper there, you have the formula. The volume of a cylinder is pi r squared times h. Okay. Today, again, we're going to use 3.14 for pi when we type that into our calculators. And then we know that r is the radius and h is height, right? Okay, so this first one here, number one, I have this cylinder and it looks like our radius is six inches and our height is four inches. So I'm going to write my formula. I want to use volume equals pi r squared h. All right. Now let's put those numbers into our formula. So I'm going to keep my pi there. And what was r? Six. six. All right, so six squared. And then h was four. Okay, so we're just going to type into our calculator. What's 6 squared? 36. 36. All right. Let's multiply. We can go ahead and write that out. We'll write 3.14 times 36 times 4. So go ahead and multiply that in your calculator. I don't know if you can see. And I believe your assignment today, we're rounding to the nearest. I didn't put rounding instructions, but let's round to the nearest All right. today. All right, so what did we get? 452.16. Okay. 452, and then what are we going to round that to? Uh, 0. 0.2. And what what is this? We're doing we're, we're doing volume. It's inches, but it's what? cubed, right? We need to have that, we need to label it, we need to have our inches cubed. Okay. All right, so number two. Number two, look carefully at that. We have two pieces of information that we're given. We have 10 feet, but look, that looks like it's the diameter, not the radius, right? We need the radius, so how are we going to find that? Jonathan? Divide by two. Divide by two, okay. So we're going to have pi times what? What is the radius? Five. five squared. And then times the height. What's the height here? Eight. Eight. All right, so what is five squared? Twenty-five. All right, so I don't think we can see my calculator up here. Uh-oh. Yeah, the lights right above yeah. really reflect. <laughs> All right, so punch 3.14 times 25 times 8. 628, is that what everybody else got? Uh, yeah. All right. No rounding. All right, 628, but I need to put a label on it. What is it? Not squared, right? Because we're dealing with volume. Yeah, cubed. <laughs> All right. All right, so let's look at number three. All right, so what what is our radius in this one? 
7. All right, so we need to do we need to have pi times 7 squared times what? 14. 14 is our height, right? All right, so let's punch 3.14 times what's 7 squared? 49 times 14 in our calculators. Okay, what did everybody else get? Everybody get that? 2,154, but then we have to round, right? So what are we going to round to? It was nothing, it's 0, 4. To, to point 0, right? Mm -hmm. All right, and now I need a label. Meters cubed. Meters cubed. you guys to work through number four okay pay attention to if it's giving you the radius or the diameter What did we get? Yeah, Alright, so I've heard a few different things. Okay. So what did... Did everyone notice that that's the diameter? Yeah. 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 All right, I got 346.19, so I'm going to round that to what? Yep. Make sure you put your label. I believe we watched it once. 